What's good guys? Welcome back to Ron's Rise News. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where we have our first look at the facelifted VW ID.3. Volkswagen has published a number of revealing teaser sketches for the upcoming ID.3 while announcing the debut for spring 2023. So now we have a release date. Now the compact EV will benefit from the minor styling changes, improved quality and animal free materials inside the cabin, plus a few technology upgrades. Now VW designers and engineers got feedback from customers in order to improve the EV and its equipment package. Interestingly, the company refers to the model as the second generation ID.3, although it's clear that we are talking about a mid-life cycle update for the EV that was originally introduced in September 2019. Now, visual changes are focused on a redesign from bumper with sportier intakes and the new bonnet, which has stronger dynamic lines doing away with the black partition of the current ID.3. Now, the rest of the body appears to be identical, including the profile and the rear end. Now, even the alloy wheels and the lighting units look unchanged, although the LED tech could be offered from a lower trim. Now, moving inside, the centerpiece is larger with a 12-inch touchscreen for the infotainment that will gain new software and will still be compatible with over-the-air updates. The new screen will come standard in all trims and is combined with a slightly updated digital instrument cluster and a much larger head-up display. You can also see the simplified climate vents on the dashboard, a new design for the center console featuring two cup holders, and a removable storage compartment. Now, the characteristic gear shift lever of the current ID.3 is gone while the play and pause graphics on the pedals are carried over. An interesting detail is the touch sensitive buttons on the steering wheel that will appear to be unchanged in the sketches, although VW has confirmed they will be replaced by physical buttons in future models following criticism from its customers. Now, more importantly, VW has pledged to improve the interior quality of the ID.3 using more sustainable and animal skin free materials. In the sketches, you can see the new stitching patterns on the dashboard and door trims while you expect a less plasticky feel for the redesigned center console. Mind you, the current model has a leather wrapped steering wheel that will be replaced by a high quality leather substitute. Now, the company didn't announce any updates for the MEB underpinnings, the electric motors, or the available battery capacities. However, it previously confirmed that the ID.3 GTX hot hatch featuring more powerful dual electric motors and a sporty chassis setup. Now, VW expects a 2% improvement in the WLTP consumption range with the figures of the ID.3 due on the design updates. The plug-in charge and intelligent EV route planner functions will make life easier for ID.3 owners. And finally, in terms of ADAS, the optional travel assist will be enhanced with swarm data and park assist plus and game memory function. Now, interestingly, VW has already started accepting orders for the ID.3 in the life business style max and tour variants with the prices starting from 43,995 euros, 46,336 dollars before the government incentives. And deliveries are expected to start in the fourth quarter of 2023 due to the delays in deliveries caused by the semiconductor shortage and the order backlog. Now, VW says that existing orders of the ID.3 Pro Life Business Style Max and the ID.3 Pro S Tour models will be automatically replaced for the updated EV equivalent. So with that said, what do you guys think about our first look and teaser at the facelifted VW ID.3? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you guys did enjoy the video today, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Give the video a like, we'll help get it up in rankings. More people can see it and we'll have a bigger discussion on the facelifted ID.3. Now with that said, if you guys wanna help further support the channel, always check the links down in the description below. We have a one-time link donation from my PayPal, my Cash App, my Venmo, and my Patreon, just in case you guys want to donate an extra dollar or two to the channel. Appreciate the extra love you guys show. Thank you so much. You guys can also check out the Ron's Rise merch. Links in the description below for the new hoodies. And make sure you guys check out my social media links. Now, with that said, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, but click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. And with that said, you guys be blessed. Have a great day. And we will talk to you guys in the next Ron's Rise news video. Peace.